Hello, hello, Carter here at Macklin Ford. As promised, a video of our 2020 Escape SEL. Uh, beautiful. I love the redesign. I really think that Ford hit the nail on the head with this new version of the Escape. Um, I just love the front end. I think that looks beautiful. The body lines, it's just a really nice looking SUV. Um, yeah, I'm a fan, so uh, I don't know if you can tell, but um, sitting on all terrains, it looks like right now. So those are good for... Uh, all seasons basically you'll be uh, safe in the winter and uh, safe in the summer all that fun stuff does have remote start on the key fob and it does have your tailgate access um, uh, power lift gate i guess it's actually called you obviously can fold down the middle row there and then you have your almost full-size spare tucked down below here um, which makes for you know easy access in uh, in times of need so um yeah that's always nice fold those back down tons of room though um yeah you can fit you know a load of groceries hockey bags whatever you really need in there and then obviously uh it does have the little uh, kick feature there where you can kind of kick your foot underneath of it and it'll close by itself you got all your safety stuff with this you even have a nice little security pad here on the side i don't know if you can see that in the video and you also have your blind spot proximity key lets you in even though uh you know even if you have your key in your pocket type thing and then when you get into the interior it's uh it's really stepped up compared to you know the edge sel or the sorry the escape sels of past um you get leather all the way around which is gorgeous so front and back you have heated seats you have a heated steering wheel and I don't know if you can see there, it says to drive, press start button. So it hasn't started yet. It's just on its remote start, but I can feel this steering wheel is nice and toasty. And so is my seat. It's got the automatic temperature recognition, which is good for winter because then when you get into it, um, it's kind of already toasty, you know, uh, and vice versa for summer, it'll turn on the AC for you and stuff like that. So really slick. I'm a fan. Um, you do have your dial shifter here in the middle. You do have your different drive modes there just down below that'll include your normal eco sport and then slippery and deep snow slash sand so that kind of works with your um you know uh sh shift technology your your transmission mapping uh and the feathering of the throttle it all changes with those different drive modes just to make the driving experience a little bit better for each condition um, you also have your adaptive cruise which will basically regulate the speed uh in in kind of um, uh, accordance with the person in front of you there um, so that you're not kind of coming up on them too fast and having to cancel your cruise control. It just kind of adjusts on its own so that uh, it's a nicer, again, driving experience. That's kind of what the whole thing is about is uh, each individual's driving experience. You got all the usual suspects. You've got your uh, volume control, your cruise control, hands-free calling, voice recognition. Um, this is how you navigate this infotainment here. You have navigation built right in and you can also hook up your phone uh, via these little um, ports down here. You can do Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, whatever you prefer there. Um, you have your nice little middle console, enough to fit some stuff in. Uh, and then the um, only other thing that I'll mention, because I use it quite a bit, is your driver's seat memory where you can program in your seating position. Um, I'm a pretty big guy, so when I get into a vehicle and I'm squished up against it, uh, it it's not too uh, lovely. So, yeah, I'll, I'll basically always input my uh, driving dimensions into one of these three positions. And then at the press of a button, I can go right back to where I left off. So pretty nice. Um, this specific unit has 76,474.3 kilometers on it. So pretty low, uh, for the year, still under your powertrain Ford warranty, which is great. Um, seems like a nice unit, but uh, what I'll do, I'll fire this video off. I'll get you the Carfax and I'll get you the inspection report. And then, uh, yeah, if you like what you see, I'd love to earn your business. I'd love to host a visit. So please let me know and we'll go from there. Thanks. Bye-bye.